Pep Guardiola says Premier League title hopes will be over if Manchester City failed to beat Tottenham. Pep Guardiola believes Manchester City could bid farewell to a fourth successive Premier League title if they fail to beat Tottenham Hotspur on Tuesday evening. City travel to the capital sitting second in the standings, one point behind leaders Arsenal, but with a game in hand for Mikel Arteta's side, who beat Manchester United 1-0 on Sunday, putting them back at the top of the table. Now City must face Arsenal's North London rivals, knowing that any stumble at Tottenham Hotspur Stadium would put their title hopes in serious jeopardy before the final weekend of the season, when both City and Arsenal face home games as expected. To win, against West Ham United and Everton respectively. Tottenham's hopes of playing in next season's Champions League could end on Monday night if Aston Villa win at home to Liverpool, which would guarantee Unai Emery's men fourth place in the table and the final Champions League qualifying spot. Anything other than wins over Villa and Tottenham remains in the mix until Sunday. City's record at Tottenham's home ground since their opening in April 2019 is appalling having lost their first five games without scoring a goal although they ended that streak with a narrow 1-0 win in the fourth round of the FA Cup this season. Guardiola has no illusions about the challenge that awaits them on Tuesday evening. The Spanish coach, whose team crushed Fulham 4-0 on Saturday, said, This is the team we play with twice this season. If we don't win we won't win the Premier League so that's what we have to do. Playing there, at Tottenham, always requires a big effort, especially this season. They are very aggressive. At Anfield they lose 4-0 but they continue to stick to what they believe in. There are difficulties but we know what we are playing for. We played well there a few times but we couldn't score or win games. We are trying to do something special so we have to do it this time. This is the time to do it otherwise Arsenal will be the champions. The mentality is what we have to do to win the game. Other situations can't be in your mind because everyone knows what we are playing for. We know how difficult it is to be in this situation again but we have something unique in front of us. Tottenham are playing for the Champions League so they have a big goal but we have a big goal too. After a positive start to the season under new manager Ange Postecoglou, Tottenham recently hit a low point at the worst possible moment as they suffered four successive defeats to Newcastle United, Arsenal, Chelsea and Liverpool, conceding 13 goals along the way. The losing streak ended on Saturday with a 2-1 win over Burnley that saw the Clarets relegated, meaning Postecoglou avoided becoming the first Tottenham manager since Ossie Ardiles in 1994 to lose five games in a row. Despite the victory, Tottenham remains dependent on Villa losing points if it wants to grab fourth place, and its Australian coach does not feel comfortable with his excellent record at home against City recently. My last record at home against them is one game and one loss, Postecoglou said. So I wouldn't gain any confidence from that. What I do take confidence from is that we have an opportunity to measure ourselves against the best. A team that is constantly striving for titles. We want to emulate them one day and the best way to do that is to test yourself against them. We will play our football and see where it takes us. Any time you play Manchester City, especially at the end of the season when they always seem to be at their best, it's a hell of a challenge. Winning is always going to be difficult, but that's the exciting thing. As for City, which is seeking to obtain its fourth consecutive historic title. It's unbelievable, he added. Sometimes, people think that once you win it, it gets easier but it becomes more difficult. You have a target on your back and you have to constantly try to climb the mountain again, knowing that they have always done that. Especially in the Premier League with the demands of the competition. They are always fighting on multiple fronts. It's a testament, not just to Pep but to the whole organization and how they want to achieve success.